1927, Professor Thomas Parnell at the University of Queensland set up what would become the world's longest-running laboratory experiment, known as the pitch drop experiment. Parnell wanted to demonstrate that pitch, a derivative of tar that appears solid and can shatter when struck with a hammer, is actually an extremely high viscosity liquid that flows very slowly over time. He heated a sample of pitch, poured it into a sealed glass funnel, allowed it to cool for three years, then cut the stem of the funnel in 1930, beginning the painfully slow drip process. The experiment demonstrates extreme patience as pitch flows at room temperature at a rate approximately 230 billion times slower than honey. In the experiment's nearly 100-year history, only nine drops have fallen, the first taking eight years to form and fall, with subsequent drops occurring roughly once per decade. Remarkably, despite the experiment running continuously since 1930, no one has ever actually witnessed a drop falling. They've either fallen when no one was watching or when monitoring equipment malfunctioned. In 2000, a webcam was set up to capture the falling drops, but when the eighth drop fell in November 2000, the camera malfunctioned at the critical moment. The experiment was awarded an IG Nobel Prize in 2005, celebrating scientific achievements that first make people laugh and then make them think. Today, the ninth drop is forming under the watchful eye of Professor Andrew White at the University of Queensland, with estimates that it may fall sometime in the 2020s, continuing this remarkable demonstration of physics and patience. Scientists estimate the experiment could continue for at least another hundred years before the funnel empties, making it not only the longest-running laboratory experiment, but also one that spans multiple human generations of scientific observation.